Mr. Varma, so, you know, since you have made a number of movies on Daud Ibrahim as well, you know, one of your films was on him. Politicians uh, having fallen victim to gang-related attacks uh, hmm. is nothing really new. You know, it reveals the yeah. known dark underbelly of Mumbai. Uh, and and do you think this is completely out of the blue or completely new kind yeah, of see, would... crime which is emerging? Huh. I think this is a very new kind of a thing because see, the underworld is more like a like a business organization. Though it does crime, though it does violence, sometimes to fast track uh, their uh, reasons for getting money. And I'm not saying this particular gang is not into that. But additionally, uh, I think the character of Lawrence Bishnoi is apt to take into consideration here. Like on one hand, he says he wants to take revenge on uh, a film star for killing a deer. And then he will say, uh, it could be extortion. Then they, he has got some patriotic fervor, like, you know, like rumors of uh, him helping the government uh, to fight some rebels against the government. So I think there are many hats which uh, this gang is uh, wearing, which is not very, uh, I mean, uh, unlike the earlier gangs, what you, what you were just talking about. So I think, and if you look at it because of the social media phenomena, he's gathering quite a lot of attention. To give an example... I have 6 million followers and uh, I put a tweet about him yes. and it got uh, nearly 6 million views. And that just is an indication of uh, what kind of interest he rose in the, in the public, in the public's mind. Yes, the public are always fascinated with Johns, which is the reason we make films and uh, all, all that. So I think uh, he's almost getting a cult following, which is a very, very new thing, which I, I don't think I've ever experienced uh, something like that.